Hello viewers and welcome to my channel, it's Lena here from DigitalLearner.com and what I want to do in this video tutorial today is just to run you through on how to buy Bitcoin on the new ways you can buy Bitcoin. Normally the previous video I had on my channel about Luno, Luno because of the ban from CBN on the banks staying away from anything that has to do with crypto, Luno has um, deactivated that um, means of buying bitcoin using your credit or debit card so you can no more buy bitcoin using the luno platform but uh here i want to show you how to buy bitcoin with binance and then remitano with this you can buy with your credit card you can buy with p2p here you can buy with p2p so i'm going to walk you through um every step you need to actually buy bitcoin using binance now, if you don't have an account with Binance, there is a link below this video description. You can go and sign up for an account. It's free. You are not paying anything to sign for an account. So I have links in the video description for Remitano and Binance. You can just go ahead and just sign up for an account for yourself. And um, if you are new to my channel, please consider subscribing. Hit the notification bell to be the first to be notified each time new videos like this are published on this channel. So to start with, I will start with Binance. Now on the Binance, um, you have different ways, up to three ways, which you you can buy Bitcoin here in Nigeria. But presently, the bank deposit has been disabled. Um, normally, you just come in here with the bank deposit. And once it's open up, you come here with the bank deposit. You have to put in the amount you are depositing here. And then, you know, just go ahead and click on and bank transfer but as you can see here it has been suspended so you can't do the bank deposit anymore so all we just need to do is to go with the second option this and this so but since you can't do bank deposit directly to binance and you know recharge your account with that bank deposit all you just need to do is to do a credit and debit card so you can buy bitcoin directly using your credit card with binance so I will just, uh, this is my favorite way anyways, if I'm to buy Bitcoin with Binance, this is my favorite way. I prefer buying with my card than buying with the P2P trade. And I will, I will explain in a little, I will show you the reasons why I prefer the card. So here, as you can see, the minimum you can buy from is uh, from 3,500 up to um, 1.8 million era. So you, this is what you can do. This depends on the level of verification of your account anyways. So once you create a free account, you just go through the process of the KYC and verify your account, both for Binance and uh, um, Remitano. So this way you can actually use. Now, for those of you who are wondering how you'll be getting your Bitcoin, Binance is actually the way forward. You can equally withdraw Bitcoin from here. Just exchange it to your Naira and withdraw it directly to your bank account. You don't have issues with that. That is why you need to you know, create an account for yourself. So once again, links will be in the video description to create a free account. So all you just need to do, let's say I want to buy Bitcoin worth a hundred thousand naira. So once I input in the amount here, all you just need to do is click, um, go ahead and select the coin you want to buy. If it is Bitcoin, go ahead and select it. If it is any other coin different than Bitcoin, just go ahead and select that. Once you select that, you click on buy BTC. So once you click on buy BTC, this pop-up comes, you just put in your card number, the expiring date, and then the CVV number. Once you put in that, you click on next, and you'll be redirected to where you need to verify um, your bank with the OTP or whatever your bank, the means your bank using in verifying transactions. So once you do that, you just click on buy, and the transaction will be successful. This, we, when you're buying with the credit, with card, it buys Bitcoin directly from Binance for you. So you will see once you come here to wallet and click on overview once that is successful it will be reflecting in your account this is one way you can buy bitcoin with binance using your credit card credit or debit card and um, this is my favorite way the other way is the p2p trading now if you have bitcoin already in your account and you want to trade it for um for your bank i will show you how to do that in a moment but with the p2p trading this is where you have people like you who actually listing um you know their bitcoin here and other coins for sale so you can go people are selling usdt selling bitcoin any of this coin you want let's say for instance we want to buy bitcoin go ahead and click on the bitcoin tab and see the offers that are available 
so here you can see how much these persons are ready to sell bitcoin the, the lowest here is 19 million this is what this person is ready to sell his bitcoin and the minimum you can buy from this person is from 500 up to a million naira and then this person from 500 up to a million this person from 10,000 yeah from 10,000 up to approximately 190k so you just go ahead and look through some of them are bank transfer all you just need to do once you go through the process of buying bitcoin you go through the process of um i'll show you let's say we want to buy bitcoin worth ten thousand this person has sells from ten thousand but the thing is that because he has sells from a minimum of ten thousand he is um, quite expensive this is one of the reasons why i prefer buying with uh with credit card i don't buy with using the p2p you can equally use the p2p to sell bitcoin anyways so I prefer buying with credit card because instead of buying this at the current price in the market, you are buying at 13.3 million, 19.3 million. Why this person is selling at 19 million, but the lowest you can buy is from um, 500k upward. So once you scroll down, yeah, people are even ready to sell at 20 million and the rest. So, uh, so these are the options you have here. Let's say we want to go with the 19.3. So means of payment here is bank transfer so i just go ahead and click on buy so basically the price change every 30 seconds um, the price here will change depending on how often the price in the market fluctuates so and then you have 15 minutes to make this transaction all you just need to do is enter the amount of um, um, naira you want to buy if it is 10,000 20,000 50,000 whatever you want to buy you go ahead and enter the amount here and automatically the system calculates and tell you the number of bitcoin that you'll be receiving with that amount of money that you want to buy so let's say you want to buy for 20 or 30k all right so this is the number of bitcoin we are going to receive for this amount just go ahead and click on buy and then the information of this person will be uh, generated for you the bank where you transfer make the transfer to and once you make the transfer you just click on upgrade and then the bitcoin will be transferred to your wallet directly here and then you can now use it to do whatever you want to do so those are the two basic way you can now buy bitcoin in nigeria using binance and once you finish buying bitcoin or let's say you are using binance to receive your cryptocurrency and you want to withdraw it to your bank that feature is still very much available if i go to overview all right so in order to receive um bitcoin um if in order to generate a wallet to start receiving bitcoin with the binance uh, uh, platform um if i go to fiat and spot what's on the overview if i go to fiat and spot on the fiat and spot here what i want to do is to look for um, bitcoin let's go ahead and search for that All right, so as I search for the Bitcoin, um, you'll see it here, it will come up here. So all you just need to do with the Bitcoin, any of this coin you want to receive anyways, um, all you need to do is to click on deposit. Um, once you click on deposit here, it will come up this way and um, this wallet will be generated for you. This is what you need. This is the wallet address that you, that you need. If you want to use Binance to start receiving your Bitcoin, this is what you need. Once you click on deposit, you go ahead, make sure that the BTC is selected, copy this address and go use it wherever or send it to wherever platform you want to. Each time they send Bitcoin here, you will receive it on your Binance account. Now, if you have Bitcoin here and you want to convert that to your local currency, and withdraw it to your bank account this is not particular to nigerians alone any country you are that uh, binance is very much active you can convert to your local currency and withdraw it to your bank so all i would just say just use the link below and check if your country is available binance will let you know if not um, you just need to look for an alternative so just copy this address now when you have bitcoin in your binance account and you want to withdraw it to your bank all you just need to do is to over where you say trade all these features are available on your phone so you if you are using a phone you can equally use it to do this once you over over the trade icon here menu here just click on convert so once you click on convert here you are converting from if it is usdt you have if it is bitcoin whatever you have for instance if i want to convert from bitcoin let's say i want to convert from bitcoin to um my naira so i just go ahead and type in ngn 
so i'll go ahead and try and select my currency here so you can go ahead and enter the number of bitcoin you have if you want to transfer everything convert everything in your account to naira to your local currency just click on max and it automatically select every of the coin you have every bitcoin you have on your account and then it tells you the what you are going to receive and then click on the convert and that will it, it, it go ahead and convert um this to your naira account now once it's converted to your naira account if you come back here to overview it will be showing up here you'll be seeing everything showing up here and once it's showing up here to show the balance and then the naira icon or your own local currency icon all you need to do click on withdraw and then from the withdraw tab here you can withdraw that money to your bank account so you can withdraw btc or withdraw fiat so in this case let's assume we have converted it and then we want to withdraw the uh, um, naira to our bank so we'll go ahead and enter the amount of naira to that we want to withdraw once you enter it you go ahead and click on continue and that is it it takes less than 30 minutes to get that money in your bank account so um, basically that is like a general overview of how to use the binance platform it is not too difficult so go ahead and give it a try and start using this platform. So if you have a platform where you want to be receiving your Bitcoin from, I will equally advise that you go with Binance and um, use the link below, create a free account. And then with this, you can you know seamlessly transact and with Bitcoin and then withdraw it to your bank account. That is number one. And then the other way is um, using Remitano. With Remitano, you can equally say equally a P2P platform. But basically, if you want to buy Bitcoin, if I come in here and say I want to buy Bitcoin, um, I just go ahead and select um, my local currency here and enter the amount of Bitcoin I want to buy. Let's say I want to buy Bitcoin worth 52K. All right, so with that selected, um, Remitano goes ahead and give me all those who are ready to sell Bitcoin at this amount. As you can see, this person is ready to sell at 18.8 million. This person 19.9. This person um, 19.1. Sorry, and um, there are people who are equally ready to sell up to as high as 20 million. So you go ahead, whatever option that it best suits you anyway. But the first one is always the lowest, and that is what I would advise for anybody who wants to use this platform to trade. Um, please make your price as uh, cheap as possible so that people can you know buy so that your coin from you faster so as it is right now this is the cheapest i can i'm getting here 18.8 million here definitely everybody who comes here will want to go with this option so that is one good tip for you if you want to use this platform to um, trade your bitcoin so um i'll go with this person so once you are satisfied with um the person you want to buy bitcoin from i prefer to go with this first person i just go ahead and click on buy and then go ahead and click on yes all right so once we click on yes the next option now is to make the payment to this um, person we're going to buy bitcoin worth this amount of money and then this is the bank account name this is the bank account number we are making the payment to and then it's first bank so the next thing i want to do here is uh, make this transaction and after making this transaction i will now submit uh, payment proof and expect this person to send um, this um, Bitcoin worth a month of this money to my account, then we can now use it. Um, so that is basically what we are going to uh, quickly run into now. All right, so let me just go ahead and make the transfer and then come back to submit the payment. All right, so I was able to send this money successfully. And another thing you should note is please transfer the exact amount you are asked to transfer. And we are buying um, Bitcoin worth 52,000 Naira, and then we are asked to send in here 52,050 Naira. So make sure you send this the exact amount. And um, once you send in that, uh, the next thing to do is to click on submit payment and the reference what you're going to reference your transaction reference should be this um, just go ahead and copy this and use it as your reference once you finish that click on submit proof and i'll go ahead and select the proof which i have um, saved on my desktop so this proof is saved here on my desktop here is it so i'll go ahead and select that 
and um, once uploaded that is it we we're able to send this successfully i'll go ahead and click on submit all right that has been submitted and um, we are done here um, basically uh, lulu uh, will just wait for the seller to you know um, reply and it appears um, it's like I have a notification here okay so we still are waiting uh, normally it takes 15 minutes so we'll just wait for this to get confirmed and if you have any issue you can always uh, chat up uh, the customer support here using their live chat you can always chat them up here so let's wait for this to be completed all right so i just gave you like two minutes and i checked back and as you can see this has been credited to our account so once you make the payment and you upload your proof of payment it doesn't take time um you can see that this has been credited it has been successfully credited to our account and then the next thing i want to show you here is um if you actually um, make any sales here um sell your bitcoin to your naira you can actually withdraw them here so um let's say i want to place a trade or whatever and i sell this coin that i have here you can you know withdraw them directly to your bank but i don't have any naira here so i cannot withdraw um so you have another option equally of depositing money directly here you come in here to select the bank you want to use um select any bank you want to use here add the amount you want to deposit and click on um, deposit an account number will be generated for you and once the account number is generated for you, all you just need to do is send the money to that account number and the money will be reflecting in your account and you can use it to, you know, transact and buy Bitcoin. So basically those are the processes. Um, they are not too difficult using Remitano. If you have any issue, you can use the comment section. If you have any other options or maybe with things I didn't mention yet, please use the comment section and um, I'll see how best I can attend to you and help you out. So basically that is how you use Remitano. Nobody should panic about uh, central bank, uh, band, uh, you know, not supporting banks who want to support crypto and the rest. You don't have issue with that with Remitano, the P2P or Remitano and then P2P or even your credit or debit card with Binance. You can actually transact with Bitcoin using these two platforms. So once again, if you are new to this channel, Consider subscribing, hit the notification bell to be the first to be notified each time new videos like this are published. And um, the links to join um, Remitano and Binance will be in the video description. And I'll see you again in my next video.